Hello, I'm Yukiko Amaya of My Goddess Path, and thank you so much for taking the time to visit me and to watch this video. I help people who are in a life situation, whether mental, emotional, spiritual, energetic, and sometimes it goes over into the physical uh, situation, um, is facing a shift or a change or a crisis. Uh, maybe it's stuck and you feel like there's no way to move forward um, or you're really looking for something other. I know these states very well because I have lived through many of them. And those different challenges in my life and a desire for change took me from being um, a very successful commercial film producer filming these commercials all over the world into studying and training to become a yoga teacher and a meditation teacher. And it took me um, into seeking help with a shamanic healer and studying with him, um, studying and certified as a soul motion conscious movement teacher and an energy healer as well as becoming a priestess of goddess and priestess of Avalon. There was a moment that I really remember, it was a real shifting moment for me. Um, I was in the middle of a very chaotic life change situation. My relationship was failing. Um, there was death in the family. And one day I woke up and uh, got out of bed and fell because there was so much pain in my left ankle that I couldn't stand. I needed a cane to walk suddenly. That really was a wake up call and it took me um, on a search for healing, which led me to an energy healer and also to understand about emotional clearing work. You know, there are um, so many things that that shift and change in the world all the time but we also need to understand that everything in life is energy even science tells us this all of life or our innate life flow energy moves towards wholeness left on its own it's the way life operates but over time say our life force energy were like this beautiful mountain stream rushing towards the ocean. And um, over time, there are rocks and boulders and trees that fall in, leaves that clog so that, that all of a sudden we have these stagnant parts and blockages to our natural flow. Does that make sense? My work with you is to really together start to remove those blockages so that your natural innate flow can be reestablished. That you yourself will be moving towards that life energy um, connected with the creative source of all life. What I call goddess is that energy, that energy of life, of that energy that connects us with the creative source so that we can come back into a place of um, confidence, of strength, clarity, empowerment, self-love. Wouldn't that be great to feel confidence centered, clear, balanced from within yourself so that you are not so dependent on what other people think or say or what they will do for you, or how they feel about you. That's the work. For example, Mary is one of the clients who came to me. She was in her early 70s and was very troubled by the fact that she would get very angry and upset with her husband, um, had numerous arguments with her daughter, and she had gone to a lot of, done a lot of therapy, but things never seemed to clear up. And so we worked together um, and identified the real source 
of all of her anger and anxiety with her husband and with her daughter. And through the clearing of that work, she was able to come into a place of balance and compassion and love. And not only that, but doing that work cleared a blockage that had actually also been blocking her artistic flow. So she is now happily back in her studio painting and really connecting with that life source energy, which nourishes us all. And there's another case of um, Akiko, a, a Japanese university student who suffered around the age of 23, 24, suffered a major uh, breakdown, mental, emotional breakdown to an extent that she really couldn't function anymore. And she had to um, stop school and her psychiatrist put her on a cocktail of drugs, but nothing seemed to be really helping. And so she was introduced to me and we started to work together on really connecting her back into her life source energy. And I'm happy to say that over the next year, um, working concurrently with her psychiatrist, we were able to slowly reduce her medication to a point where she's not taking anything anymore. And she was able to go back to university and finish her degree uh, with flying colors. And then another case would be Claudia. Um, she was a very successful yoga teacher, but there was something within her that, that really was tugging at her, that she wanted to explore these fields of energy, this uh, consciousness that I was talking about. And so she came to work with me because there was that desire, but also there was a huge amount of fear um, of these energies because they felt very dark to her, these um, ways of knowing. And um, by working together, we were able to clear that and bring her back into her real um, innate native balance. She's an incredibly psychic person, very gifted psychic person. And um, she was able to really connect with that energy fully. And not only that, but to expand her successful business from that of addressing physical issues only to really including the psychic healing work, her medical intuitive knowledge, so that she could really serve her large clientele on a much fuller basis of not only the physical symptoms, but also the underlying uh, emotional and energetic symptoms as well. So does any of this resonate with you? And for those of you that are really wanting to um, find out more of how you can go beyond where you feel you are limited or held back or the grief and the pain that you feel completely sucked in by, or the anger that you don't know what to do with, or the depression, or not being able to put your finger on something, but you know that something needs to shift and want to shift, and then please contact me. How I work is we first have a complimentary discovery session. It's a one-on-one -on -one and we talk to see what your issues are, or what you are wanting to uh, find, discover, move towards, move away from. And we can see during that discovery session if we are a good fit to work together. So I look forward to hearing from you. And until then, take good care. Blessed be.